I felt a little what felt a lot like a cramp in the first inning. Um, and I got so it just kind of worked on in the in between innings and it went away for the second and then and then I, I felt fine going into the third and then kind of got deep in the inning there and um during that I bat to Olsen it kind of came back and then sort of persisted. Um <clears throat> it just felt like a just like a cram. Did you did you think it was anything more serious when, when you came out? No. I mean you never really know because you have adrenaline, so sometimes things hurt a lot less. But you know, I you know I respect the decision to take me out, obviously. But I could have stayed in there and pitched if they needed me to. You know, it was one of those things that was you know, I think a lot more precautionary. How do you feel now with it? I feel good. I feel good. I mean, um, I'm optimistic. I think everything's gonna be fine, and so I feel I feel good. Lynn, go ahead. Hey, Daniel. Um, he's how much um, do you feel like that was, um, if it was, uh, impacting just your delivery or your follow through there, just the, the, the thing you filmed the cramp? I don't think it was. I felt like, you know, honestly, you know, aside from a few pitches, um, I felt like I was commanding the ball well. I felt like my stuff was good. Um, I felt like, you know, there's a few, you know, unfortunate things that happened, but. Other than that, I felt good about how, you know, how the delivery felt. And, you know, I think it was more than affecting anything. It was, I was trying to get it loosened up. And I think that was probably what concerned them. Um, but I didn't feel like it was affecting me too much.